Good evening and welcome back to Let's Play The Witcher. When we left off last time, I tangled with a big nasty in the hut and I died. So we are going to be much more cautious exploring this go round. Uh, possibly, I shouldn't even necessarily delve too much in this area right now. Maybe I should go look at other places. There's more we could do in the city, but I'm here and I'm curious, so we're going to do it. So off screen, I did some dicing with Vasca. I feel kind of bad. I... I diced her out of all of her money, and it was only like one round to do it, because she didn't have that much to start with. Alright. So, what are we going to do here? We need to take Gramps home. And we need to not die. Let's look at the map. Okay, there's the landing, campfire. Yeah, and Gramps wants to be way over there. Okay. Maybe I should go down this path to get there? Let's try it. This old brick -a maker He's one of I, I quite enjoy that NPC. He's one of my favorites. He seems like a nice fella, you know? I kind of want to light the fire. Okay, we'll just move. Nosy dog? Gramps? Alright. Okay, so let's have a look at the clay pits. I'm hungry again. Well... Okay. Some of that. No, get back here, Gramps. I killed him, it's fine. It's good. Oops. That is not what I meant to click. Ooh, cadaverine. Get over here. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. We're good. We're good. I killed the enemies. Nice roll. I think it's possible... Am I still using, like, the wrong sword? I'm bad at switching weapons. It is. No. Okay. So. Which sword am I using at the moment? Whatever. We'll work it all out. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot more of these guys. Look at them all lurking around up there. What's a little boy doing in there? Gramps, we gotta save the little boy, okay? Also, I feel like there should be... Enough! I'm not enough! ...on other remains that I didn't see. Alright, who's on us? This, this little boy's just walking around like it's nothing. Just hanging out in the pits, never mind all the droners. Maybe he's an evil little boy. Foggy holes must be clay pits. Yeah, they are. Come here, what's going on with you? Oh. Clay pits. This is where those lunatics work. Huh. They look normal to me. <laughs> Brickmakers pretend to be normal to strangers, yet they conceal their faith. Do you know those dimwits worship fish people? Like Innsmouth? People believe in the strangest things. Deep ones. They worship slime-covered reptiles with bulging eyes. I, those body and I can't even talk. You must communicate with them using objects. Care to elaborate? Humans communicate with fishoids by leaving objects on special altars. Each item has specific symbolic meaning and is read as an intention. The Vodianoi answer in the same manner. What kind of objects? Don't know and I don't care. You need to speak with one of the worshippers. But brickmakers don't divulge their knowledge to potential blasphemers. Dad! Alright. Okay, mostly though. Get down. If the Vaginoi are sentient and you can communicate with them, then, you know, why wouldn't you? <laughs> Alright, what are you doing here, kid? The lords are coming. Shove off. Who's above the lords? What is this crap? Is he a brick maker child? Is he talking about the lords of the Vaginoi? 
Geralt, you're going to regret ignoring that kid. Something's going to happen. Anyhow. Ah. I don't want to have any kind of quarrel with the Vojinoi if we don't have to, because we don't really have anything to indicate they're evil at this point. So, my plan's going to be to just leave them alone if I can. There are so many drowners over here, and mutilated corpses. Man, Nosy Dog and Gramps hate this. You sure you don't want to f- Nothing beats meat. You sure you don't want to follow me, little boy? Part of my entourage? Not playing that. He does not. Okay. Well. Okay, so there's the dock. Let's attempt to do this, you know, somewhat slow. Not get mobbed by them. Oh, little boy is following, isn't he? What are those green skulls flying around? I see them occasionally, and I don't feel that good about them. Enough! I've had enough! Ugh. I'm trying to loot bodies, Drowner. Get out of here. I'm also doing the wrong fighting style, but whatever. Okay. I just want to get all this stuff. There's one I missed here. Ugh, I can wait. Alright. Another drowner over there. So what, boys just kind of wandering wherever? Alright. You enjoy that, boy. Now then. Who wants to come over next? You do. Ah, both ya. Oh, we got them all. Good deal. Excellent. Well, Vasco will be glad to hear that. And maybe she'll be grateful enough that I can ask her about the Brickmaker's secrets, and she'll tell me. Nosy Dog, I kind of like you and sort of hope you will follow me throughout the rest of the game. I doubt he will, but... Okay, let's look at these mutilated corpses. Oh, and there's one of the altars. Oh, nothing beats meat. The monsters have torn a lot of flesh from this corpse. It's obvious the mortal wounds were inflicted by sword. A sharp one, at that. Now that is interesting. Some orange. Hmm. Salamander mark. And, huh, unknown. Take it all. Wait, what do you mean Berengar is dead? That was Berengar? This is Berengar? Could... Could I have saved him? Alright, followed the trail of corpses and found the place where Berengar made his last stand. By the look of things, he sold his life dearly. Well, no, I wanted to... That's not how I wanted that quest to end at all. I wanted to find him. Alive. Okay, that's just... So, this is him then? Bummer. Man. Alright. Let's go to this altar. We'll leave it alone. We don't want to accidentally send the wrong message. Yeah, there's more, like, monsters off there. Okay. We could go back and talk to Vasca. Or we could continue to the Temple of Militelli and try and get Gramps home. Maybe we should do that since we already started. Although she's just up here. 
All right, let's quick save. I figured it out because we did accomplish something. All right. Enough. I'm not enough. Whoa! Now this thing kind of messed me up last time. No, it's not. <laughs> Oh, look at that! Look at that dead person in it! That's kind of awesome! Alright. Well, I could attempt to burn it. That would probably help. But... So, let's look at all our options here. We could go kind of this way? Because it was more like over there ish, right? No, it was like right there. I mean, cut through the water and somewhat avoid it. Yeah, whatever, I can handle you guys. Gramps, it's, it's just drowners. It's not a big deal. They better not have just killed my nosy dog. There he is. You okay, buddy? I worry about you. Drown dead tongue. Okay. What is that? It looks almost like a bear out there. It'll probably kill me, but I kind of want to go up and see. I should leave it alone. I should leave it alone. It's a blood seeker. Leave it alone. Oh. Yeah, I don't actually want to fight you. We're just gonna go around this way. All right, Gramps. Why do you why do you live out here? It's terrible. Thing, plenty of space. Hmm, the awful is gay. Crow's eye. It's interesting. Yeah. Enough. Come on, enough. It's just a drowner. Saddle it down. You're gonna be fine. Oop. Okay, so you know it's. And there's a lot of them. It's, it's potentially a bad thing. Dang it. We got a little bit to redo. That's fine. We're gonna make it to this temple. Now then. Let's go. Just run for it, Gramps and Nosy Dog. It'll be fine. We're on the move. Hopefully they'll be okay. I'm poisoned. That's what it is, isn't it? So what? It's like a plant. Okay. Um. Okay. Huh? What do we think it is? Let's try it. Makes hidden opponents visible. Interesting. Okay. And. What, am I really out of swallow? That's a bit of a problem. Well. I'm probably gonna die then.
Where's your temple? I passed it. Oh, this just the shrine? He just wants to be at the shrine? That's all? Enough! Bleh. Okay. Well. Let's go back to the village on Talvaska that we cleared things out. And then maybe we'll come up with some kind of plan after that. Sorry, Gramps. Escorting you home is turning out to be kind of a pain in the butt. I will fall on my face into dust. The lords approach like rising waters. Hey. They ascend like kings to the throne. You want a thrashing? <laughs> Call thee from the depths. Come. What the hell? For I tell thee, who is above the lords? Okay, so he's calling the deep ones, the Vaginoi. But he's just, he's not dressed like a brick maker, is he? I mean, he seems kind of fancy. I'm not playing that. Alright. I wonder if Old Brickmaker would tell us about the ways. Ah, right. Veska? Want to ask something? I have killed the Drowners. I've killed the Drowners. You showed us mercy, yet I deceived you. Oh. I can offer no money, but you cannot leave unrewarded. Take this amulet. It's Kezath, the symbol of mercy. Will do. Wonderful. Now we prepare for the coming of the lords. Now, about that. These lords? We worship them and receive the grace of those from the eternal deep. I keep thinking of the fish people, Vodinoi. How dare you? Those names offend the lords. Sorry, I didn't know. Don't get all upset. Alright. Come talk to me some more. Return later. Okay. I meet the lords? All right, old brickmaker, will you tell me about the lords? I want an ah, uh, never mind. Farewell. Okay, well let's look at this amulet we got. Could be cool. Where's it at? Organize everything. Maybe that'll help. So amulet, amulet, amulet. It's probably like right in front of me, staring me in the face, and I'm just having some trouble here. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we gotta put it in the, the things. Okay, okay. Alright. So, potion-wise, there's not really much we can do, is there? No, we don't have what we need. What are we missing here? Better alchemical base required. All this stuff sucks, huh? Well, oh, bummer. That's all I really want. Okay. Well, let's get out of here. Completed a quest at any rate, that's something. There. Now, do 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 do. So, where do we want to go, Gramps? Just running for the temples, not really working out well. Heading out this way got us killed last time. I kind of want to mess around with all of these obelisks, though. I think I'm gonna do it. The obelisk seems ancient. Pity I don't understand these runes. Let's mess around with it. Zephira and obelisk merged. The old spells still work. Nosy dog, where'd you get off to?
Where's, where's my dog? Bummer. Okay. Yes, Seth, but we don't have Yes, Seth. We have Kazad or something like that. The old road. Oh. Hey there, cat. Hmm. I kind of wanted to strike out in the swamps because we can, but I think it's a bad idea. Oh, I did want to look at that corpse. I just kind of want to see what our boundaries are. Oh, that's it. That's the boundaries. Right? No? Maybe a little bit of invisible wall? Okay. Well. Alright, corpse. Assassin's dagger and some horns. That'll do. Now, we could go that way, or we could... This island hut went badly last time, so I might should leave it alone for now. Hmm. Yeah, that's just their village again. Well, let's go back this way. have to fight some of these at some point. Probably now. Let's start with this one. Yeah. Enough. I'm on enough. Enough. I'm on enough. Enough. I'm on enough. Enough. I'm on enough. Okay, we good for now? Gramps, get out of this swamp. Okay. Enough. Ugh. I've had enough. Always more. You as well, huh? And now this thing's on me. So, we'll just go for it. It's gonna be okay. Ah, there we go. Ew! Very good. And just hang out a second. Lots and lots of quick saves. So. Tipperath, huh? Man, there's a lot of these things I'm gonna need to find. Okay, so we could go over here or we could try to bear sort of northwest. I think I'd like to do that. That's kind of where he said the uh, um, druids are, right? Eh. What bizarre creatures those are. Enough! I've had enough! Enough. Oops. Get it. 
I'm clicking it all the wrong times because I'm getting a little panicky. Oh, really? <laughs> what a bummer. Alright, so I need to be a lot more careful going through here, basically. Alright, Gramps. Let's cut through somewhat here. I'm not fighting you. I'll fight you, though. There we go. Just come on over here. We'll be fine. Off. I still don't know what that crow's eye is all about, and I do want to... There's gonna be a million. Th There's one over here too, so it's gotta be a plant, right? Great. Enough. Come on over, boys. Enough. I've had enough. Enough. I've had enough. enough. Quickly. I've had enough. Nope. Maybe I really needed to. Focus on like getting the jacket and stuff before I come out here. Alright, well I would really like to get you where you need to go, Gramps, before I decide to go back and save this place for later. west, a little bit south, which means we mostly need to be going that way, a little bit south, so let's do this. Yeah, part of the trouble is that you can't see the drowners ahead of time enough. to anticipate them. They just show enough. up whenever. Enough. Enough. Take it easy, Gramps. It's gonna be fine. Okay, so there's the off. And we just continue on the path, and it's right up ahead. Alright, go ahead. Enough! I've had enough! Enough! I've had enough! Enough! I've had enough! There are so many of them right here. We gotta run a little bit, Gramps. Yeah, I don't see this happening. There was an ambush waiting for us. That last time. Three women. This reminds me of something. There's an altar at the base. Save me, Melatelli.
Did I just leave Gramps alone in the woods? Yeah. We're safe, though. Okay, so what does that do um, for a quest? Because I don't really want to fail that quest, but I also don't want to die again. Where was he? I took him to the Malatelli Shrine. Okay. Follow Gramps all the way. Well, we can just go back there sometime, right? It doesn't say I failed it, so we're going to move on and assume things are okay. Yeah. How's it going there, buddy? Hmm. I need... Mm. High quality base for bombs. No, I need some good base for potions. Hmm. Alcahest? Very pure. That might be the thing. Vampire repelling talisman. Garlic. I could. I could buy it and put it on. I almost might as well. I don't have anything else there. Uh, let's... Well, actually... Let's just find somewhere. If I pay attention, he can probably let me sleep here, won't he? Yep. Just need a nap for a bit. Just like an hour should do. Oh, better. Now then. So I do want to go back to the swamp. But also maybe I should take a minute to do some things here. So, what do we got going on? I gotta dice people. There is the house with the wine cellar. Let's go do that. Over here, so west and a bit south. Okay. Black, how's it going? For two. Tell me about this. Stop pestering. All right. For two. I know you don't want that. Would you like some vampire fangs? Stop pestering me. For two. Someone told me something to give him, and I don't remember what it was. Shadow people. Oh. You know who I am. <coughs> I thought that scroll had disappeared for good. How can I thank you? <coughs> this ring of the prophet Lebioda is my only thing of value. The elderly <coughs> esteem it. Pilfered it off some <coughs> at a shelter. You stole from someone at a shelter? It's kind of terrible. The elderly esteem it. So is this like a gift giving quest? You gotta find the right people to give the proper gifts to? Valuable item which can be sold or given to someone and the elderly esteem it. What about at the- I know I'm getting turned around from what I was doing, but at the temple you could show that guy a ring, right? Or the hospital. Nope, I'm going inside. Disease pay. Does he care about this ring? Wasting my time. Nope. All right. You bring trouble.
All right, this one, right? That seems to be what my map is telling me, right? Right? There. Abandoned house. Oh boy. Kill it! Kill it! Now this one's gonna get me. Especially because I'm freaking out. Bummer. Okay, but if I potion up first, then I should be able to do that, right? Alright, where's my last? Auto save. Auto save? Dang it! I gotta do better at this. Well. So, back here again. Just go along the path, but there's all those guys. Enough! How about enough? Enough! How about enough? Oh, you. Wasn't sure what he was freaking out about. Just take him out the fast way. Enough. Enough. Now that. What we're gonna do, Gramps, is we're gonna try to go. Yeah, sort of where you are. And see if we can sort of like head down and around to this thing. Oh, one of these. Enough. How about enough? Enough. How about enough? Enough. How about enough? Enough. How about enough? All right, time to run. Burial ground. Open, open. This won't actually work, will it? Because there's enemies like right there. Will it? Excellent. All right, let's look at this corpse. Ooh, a lot of orange on this guy. His axe will stay. Islands and golems, eh? Okay, I should leave them alone. But I won't. Odd place. Looks like these giants froze mid motion. Must have been some time ago. Huh. What could I give you that you would be interested in? deserved that. <laughs> That's what I get for mucking about with strange things in the swamp. Okay, so Odd place. Looks like these giants froze mid motion. Must have been some time ago. Don't mess with the pylons, just just leave them alone. Oh look at these ones coming out of the ground. Cool. Okay, well, I want to take him to the temple, and I should- I could just go, like, straight south and get there, but what's all this up here? Where is this path going? I'm curious. Huh? The tower's back in here somewhere, right? So, I mean, this is surely going somewhere interesting. There's the Chakma Oblisk and Wolf. 
bunch of wolves. Well, a couple wolves. Marshland. Okay, it's it's a pack of wolves. We should leave them alone. So really, what should we should do? I wonder if you have to hit the pylons in a proper order, and maybe that would do it. Okay, I'm getting so distracted. I need to just go to the Melatelli altar, but what's in the baskets? Oh, are these offerings for the the old ones or whatever? The Vaginoi? We'll leave them be. Another fireplace. Good to know. And now these wolves aren't enemies? Interesting. Okay, so we're here, and really we just need to go east and a little bit south. Let's do it. Gramps, you still hanging around? Yeah. Venopolis, there's so many of those. Okay, I also want to look at this crow's eye. that shining in the darkness. Okay. Yeah, just straight east and we're there. That might be my altar shining in the darkness, huh? With blood zakers in the way. Whatever. We can take them out. Just go easy and we'll be fine. Yeah, there it is. No five pack of drowners, please. Oh my gosh, there's like a million of those things over there. Just... Here we go. Gramps, get over here! We did it! Here we are. Thank you, son. You're welcome. I'm not your son. This is a weird place to want to be. Visit me sometime. I'll show you my books, serve you some tea, and go. Oh, Goulash. I hate Goulash. I met another of your kind recently, but he lacked courtesy. He demanded to know about the Circle of Elements. Okay, I would like to know about the Circle of Elements, but first... I mean, it's... He demanded to know about the Circle of Elements, and then for me to turn around and be like, What about the Circle of Elements? It sounds awful lot like I'm demanding to. Um, so... The Vanguard you must have met. Another Witcher? What can you tell me about him? Well, not much, son. He wanted about asking questions, and looking like one with a sour stomach. I'm not so interested in that. Yeah, I know, I know. He feared something, or someone. Spent most of his time near the pits where those village idiots burrow in clay. And we found him. Thanks, Gramps. That helps. So, that's a bit I did out of order, eh? Now I need to pray in peace. Well, where are you going? Three women. This reminds me of something. There's an altar at the base. So, I could take this back. We have accomplished... Let's not die, because we have accomplished something here. And... We could just go right back now. But we could explore more, too. Like, what's over here? I should really go back, but I'm going to explore more, because I'm a fool. What's is that guy Omni? No, not quite. Do, 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 just traipsing through the swamp in the rain. Always a good idea. Yaren Bolt. Okay, let's get this first. Now then. 
And who might you be? You lost? Who are you? Geralt the Witcher, a friend. And we'll see. And you? Yaren. I speak for the lumberjacks. Okay. Can we talk? Speak. So. Any jobs for a witcher? Despite the danger, the beasts leave us alone. So nothing. Perhaps for someone willing to take a risk. All right, what you got? I'm listening. But the begetic plant should be blooming in the swamp. I understand it's valuable. The drug it makes is. Collect some blossoms, and we could both earn a little. I wade through mud, face danger, then we split the profit. You don't know what beggar tip looks like, nor where to sell True. it. True. Is this something I think Geralt would actually do? Mm, quite possibly not. And is this like an illegal sort of bad drug he wants us to make? Not entirely clear, but I'm a sucker for quests, so. Okay, let's play herbalist. Great. Begatip blossoms look like red orchids. Clumps grow throughout the swamp. Sell them to the ferryman. Ask those living in the swamp if you can't find them. All right. I'll deliver the flowers to the ferryman as soon as I find them. Now, in the meantime, don't keep talking to me. Speak. So. Are you responsible for the logging? No, we scare off woodpeckers. Of course we're responsible. We're lumberjacks. Work for yourselves or someone else? We're independent, though we secure orders from merchants like Luvarden. We get weeks of work and a decent return. <laughs> so. You the chief lumberjack? Yes. Without me, these lazy lads wouldn't know when to piss. Him with a moustache. No matter what I do, he still pisses in his boots. <laughs> I see you keep a tight rein. With danger around, you need discipline. I rule with an iron fist so they can return home safely. Most will. All right. Get along with the locals. Nothing but a bunch of deviants. The brickmakers babble about their lords and the underwater world, and the druids don't like the trees being felled. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think I don't. The brickmaker, I don't have a problem with them and their lords, but I probably, I don't know, would think they're kind of weird too, and maybe just leave them be. But I wouldn't be hostile towards them. I could see where druids and lumberjacks would have a problem with each other. Are you responsible for the logging? I already no, said that. Why did that? Okay, and we asked him that. Work for you. Was there? There we go. Don't you fear working in such a dangerous area? These men need the gold, so they take the risk. You can't have pork if you don't kill the piglet. Do these trees have special value? The remains of a primeval forest, <gasps> rare species. They make excellent wainscoting. Oh, that's horrible. Rare species, the remains, and we're just gonna use them for wainscoting. The you could use like a, a cheap pine or something for wainscoting and just put a nice stain on it. Like, leave the rare trees alone. You lost my sympathy, lumberjack. Godspeed. Although it was kind of nice to find someone out here. Alright. Let's see. So, north is mostly what I want to do now, I think. Go through this corner, see if I can find the druids. What? What? And so I immediately start going the wrong way. Okay. Ba -da 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 -da, da -da 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 -da. Mm. That's kind of a bit of a wall here, huh? So this must be about as far west as I can go. And green wolves, so they're not gonna attack, right? We can all be friends. Are they gonna be mad if I go in here? Oh, look at this! It's all nasty and rainy and crap out there, and it's beautiful in here. And they've even got a wyvern. Yeah, the wolves are like, oh, hey, how's it going? Is there a nosy wolf who'd follow me and be my friend? Who are you? Windblade. Oh, Warren, huh? Gwynblade? What's that mean? It's you, Geralt. Gwynblade. What's that mean? White Wolf. You know me? Your name precedes you. You may know more than me. I remember nothing of my past. Some things are better forgotten. Nevertheless, I do feel sorry for you. 
Can you help? Sadly, no. Perhaps my sisters from Brokilon could help, but they are far away. What are you doing so far from them? What are you doing here? It is a secret. Though I'm taking the chance to visit this grove of old, beautiful trees. That the loggers are trying to slice down. Tell me about Brokilon. Brokilon is the Dryad homeland. A wilderness untouched by humans. Those surrounding Brokilon wish to claim our forests and thus humans and Dryads fight continuously along the borders. Who is winning? Our archers are matchless. But how long can we resist the brute force that rendered humans the world's rulers? Hmm. Why don't you reach a compromise? They refuse to compromise. Why don't you reach a compromise with the humans? Ha! Huh. You treat concessions as weaknesses and believe acts of goodwill are traps. You will never accept our otherness. I think some humans probably would. But others wouldn't, yeah. So you agree with the elves and dwarves fighting for independence? Those children? They have long forgotten the struggle's meaning, craving blood and revenge, having only contempt for humans. They fail to see they begin to resemble the humans themselves. We merely defend our home, Gwynblade, and have no ambition of driving humans into the sea. All right. Tell me about your lives. Brokilon is our home, Ithlin our lady. We live in harmony with the forest, flowing through the thickets and knowing the forest secrets. Are you happy? Like humans, we have joys and sorrows, though our end is near. The war with the humans continues, and our numbers diminish. I do feel really bad for him. It's unfortunate that all the forces are so hostile. You know. The dwarves, the elves, the dryads, the humans. I'd like them to be able, ideally, to get along. It's sad, to, it's sad to see them going out of the world. And I can understand why they feel as they do. And they have such hatred for humans. Because humans are outpacing them and taking over. That's sad. All right, I guess that's all she's got to say. How's it going, buddy? Circle of unwanted power. All right, that's interesting. And some druids over there. Ooh, we got hostile wolves over there. This guy I should probably really talk strange to. Trees, strange symbols, tamed beasts, even a dryad. This must be the druid's grove. Yep. All right. Well, this is certainly an interesting place to be. I think I'm gonna go ahead and actually wind the episode down here. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. Come back and next time we're gonna chat with everybody in the druid's grove. And you know, there's more. It looks like we can even go more north of here. I kind of want to just open up this map and see what else we can find out here. We do need to go back to town eventually. There's things to do there, but right now there's nothing immediately attempting to kill me, so we might just explore a little bit more.